I was hoping you'd come to chat. What do you need? Wouldn't you be in my place? If there's even the slightest chance that Shah worshippers remain within our reach, we should try and find them. Even if they're all long gone, and that seems quite likely from what we know, who knows what they may have left behind for us to use? My people are nothing if not resourceful. As long as I've prayed to Lady Shah, I've wished to serve her as a dark justicia. There is scarcely a greater way to fully dedicate yourself to Lady Shah, save perhaps if you become the head of her church. To become a dark justicia is to become the Night Singer's sword arm. Her implement with which she will cast down the unbelievers and win the final battle to restore her perfect, endless darkness. It's all I ever wanted. I prayed it was my calling. But Mother forbid me from seeking to prove myself worthy of the rank. She said I was not ready. Not my mother mother, I should add. The Mother Superior. Head of Lady Shah's enclave in Baldur's Gate. Sometimes I wonder if she would ever deem me ready. I owe her everything, and I only wish to serve, yet she can prove... inscrutable. What's on your mind? I suppose some would commend our actions. Goblins would have raised that whole place to nothing if it weren't for us. No excuse to rest on our laurels, though. We've still got our own problems to contend with. Life into our enemy's flesh. The dead make a fine host for my growing children. You may not. The spores hear only the circle. They dance to no other harmony. You know. I've been catching myself smiling more lately. I think that's your fault. Really? Save your prayers for someone who at least had the spine to fight back. Health. That's quite a view. What happened here? I'm not sure I want to step in. Stand by me if you need to keep warm in this awful place. This is no ordinary darkness. It feels powerful and familiar. These lands have been blessed by Lady Shah. You must learn more about her presence here. I've never seen darkness like this before. It's unsettling. Darkness or not, we need to reach Moonrise Towers. The Shadow Curse. It doesn't seem to affect me like it does others. Not as badly, at least. Do you know what this means? I must be blessed. Lady Shah is protecting me where others are left to face her wrath. She loves me. She must do. Carried away? Hardly. The proof is right there. Just be grateful someone can handle this place. 
Lady Shah wouldn't bless me like this for no reason. There must be something she wants of me. Those signs we found about Dark Justicias, perhaps they were no coincidence. In either case, I need to watch for any place dedicated to Lady Shah. A temple, perhaps. Huh. So, that's what people mean when they talk about butterflies in their stomach. Did you want something? The objective of the Scalpel Sisters is to soothe. For the Scalpel, indeed, is an extension of Shah. See how the patient reacts when I but stroke the right nerve. Hear its comfort, hear the very melody of mercy. <laughs> Pray, sister, show us the extent of your beneficence. Stop. Stay your hand. But it slaps where it should stroke. We can hardly hear the patient sighs of solace. Perhaps it is our unexpected audience that makes you quiver. Come, step forward. You are no sister, but that matters none. Every student is welcome. Just the heart of Shah so very perfectly. It is the scalpel-led journey that leads from pain to peace. A stinging truth, but a truth nonetheless. See, what is the light of eyes but the cancer that causes one to witness the laceration of being? If light it's the symptom, then darkness is the cure. For in light there is presence, but in darkness there is absence. In light is presence, in darkness, absence. But you, look how the sucker of Shah eludes you. See how painfully present you remain. We do not wish to see you suffer so. Let us cure you. I was hoping you'd come to chat. What do you need? Very serious of you. But go ahead. Well, I'd be lying if I said I hadn't been dwelling on becoming a Dark Justice here. Perhaps seeing the power of Shah unleashed on that land is keeping the thought in my mind. But don't worry. I still have plenty of room for you in both mind and heart. Fine. What's on your mind? Quite splendidly, to give credit where it's due. You and I have shared some good times together, and it seems we have plenty in common. Considering all we've been through, I think I was very lucky to find such favorable company. And attractive company too, no less. It's about time Halston actually stepped up and joined us properly. He's certainly been taking up space at camp for long enough. If you're sure. Fine. 
I'll be here whenever you rediscover your taste in company. No matter. She wishes for Kethrick Thorn to be punished. Her darkness was a blessing offered before he betrayed her. She can redirect her powers elsewhere once he is cast down. Rings a bell? Why? Oh, hells. You didn't pick that by hand, did you? They're deadly poisonous. Joking. They're safe. And beautiful. Thank you. I don't have anything to give you in return, I'm afraid. Well, perhaps I can come up with something later, all the same. Well, my day just improved. Did you want something? Very serious of you, but go ahead. I won't pretend that I don't know what you mean. Ever since we entered the Shadow Curse, I felt like something's calling to me. Some purpose that I need to find. Give me some time. If I can figure out whatever it is that I need to do, well, then there should be more time for us. This must be the way forward. Where will it bring us, though? Lady guided me here. She she wanted me to find this place. Cross from light into darkness. Give your life to the shadows. in darkness. Shah's warriors must not be tricked. Must not be tricked. Only loss awaits the unworthy. A voice. Is that Shah herself who speaks? Welcome, child. Follow my voice and prove your worth. Be wary. This place is trapped. of offering to the Dark Lady. May she embrace the entire world.
pleasurable shiver runs down your spine. You feel as if you've unburdened a troubling thought and forgotten it forever. The gauntlet of Shah. I can't believe it. I can't believe we found the Dark Lady's sacred crucible. Overwhelming. Worship of Lady Shah is usually discreet by nature. Her holy sites have to be modest, well hidden. But that place... I never knew such grandeur had been built in her honor. The Gauntlet of Shah is no ordinary temple. It is the highest test of the Dark Lady's faithful. To judge if they are worthy of becoming a Dark Justicia. The Gauntlet has double meaning. It speaks of the ordeals to be overcome, and of the armor-clad fist of Lady Shah that would embrace the worthy. Survive the crushing Gauntlet, and be embraced by the Night Singer at its very core. The old ways were lost over time. Now some claim the rank simply by killing a single Saloon Knight. But before, they were a true elite. Many would attempt the trials, but few would succeed. The bowl contains an ancient, rust-colored bloodstain. It forms a neat disc, as if spilled calmly and willingly. This is one of Lady Shah's trials. Allow me. It's important. of an ancient blood offering. Another trial. Allow me, please. stains of an ancient blood offering. Another trial. I need to do this same as before. Until we shed that which holds us back. Bowl bearing the stains of an ancient blood offering. Another trial. Allow me, please. is an inscription. Brave the gauntlet of your Lady Shah, surmount her trials, and rise a dark justicia. The gauntlet of Shah. This place is legendary. Even with half my memories locked away, I still remember the stories. 
The Dark Lady's finest warriors arose from this place. Now I'm here. In order to join Lady Shah's elite, you had to pass her trials, then make a sacrifice in her innermost sanctum. One revealed only when you've proven yourself. Very few made it that far. I've dreamed of this place. This is my destiny. I must complete the trials. What does it mean? It means we'll have power. Power we can use to take on the Absolute and rid ourselves of these parasites, once and for all. If I become a Dark Justice here, I'll have Lady Shah's highest blessing and her arsenal at my disposal. This will be good for all of us. Let's explore. Wait. You detect the gentlest of presences disturbing the temple's ancient, stale air. It seems to encircle Shadowheart, welcoming her. My lady, Shah, you may have felt her, but I heard her. She gave me a mission. There is a holy weapon hidden away, the Spear of Night. I have to claim it, then use it to make a sacrifice in Lady Shah's inner sanctum. If I succeed, I'll become a Dark Justicia. Don't worry. This place has been empty for years. The sacrifice can't be a simple mortal. More likely it's a monster. And we're well versed in dealing with those, aren't we? We need to get that spear. Supposedly it's in the library we saw before. This challenge remains the same. There's nothing more for us to do here. Not until we complete Lady Shah's trials. There are recesses on the altar that look intended to house something. Another such reception. This has to be it. This has to be the Spear of Night. The weapon Lady Shah bid me to wield. undertook their final preparations. The end is near. Trust your secrets to the night. Shroud yourself in blackest night. Must be the last step. I need to pray. Only by Lady Shah's grace did we even make it this far.
You feel your mind slip into Shadow Hearts. But you are not the only one present. There is another. Ancient, commanding, rendered from purest darkness. Sharp. Take my spear. Step forward and strike down the Salunite. As you command. Now go. Warm my blade with moon-crazed blood. And be wary of your companion. He pries in your thoughts. That wasn't for you to hear! It's simple. My Lady Shah demands a sacrifice. One life. Not that it matters, but her reward aligns with your own interests. Please. How many breathed their last just so we could make it this far? Trust me. This will help us. Remember what I said. Let me do what I need to. Your party is gathered. You are ready. Or so you hope. As you step into the silent water, a foreign dread travels through you. It curls its way up your leg. Squeezing tight. I have felt you coming. The first in a century. You, who have come to seek the praise of your wicked goddess. You, who have come to drive a dagger through my heart. Not a dagger, a spear. My Lady Shah's spear. Her fate is mine to seal, let me handle this. The fate you seal is your own. To be a dark justicia is to turn your heart from everything but loss. You will know no love, no joy, only servitude, until of course your mistress inevitably discards you. And there is much she does not tell you. A terrible blood price that may extend beyond my own death. You feel Shadow Heart bristling. This is important to her your bond is strong. You may yet be able to sway her from the path of duty to the path of light. And Night Song is not blind to your conflict. Behind that raging heart is the restless beat of one who knows too well that her fate hangs in the balance. I have to step over your corpse to fulfill what Lady Shah asks of me. So be it. Your choice. Well, well, well. 
What's that I sense? A spear intended for my heart? Empowered by your goddess, I... Empowered to kill the child of a god! Do you know what I am, little assassin? For I know you. A lost child. Frightened by wolves in the dark. What did you say? Much has been promised to you, hasn't it? But what has been taken from you? What do you know of your own heart? Your own life? I sense more in you than you know. Whatever you think you know of me won't matter once I become who I'm meant to be. I can't believe I just did that. Lady Shah will disown me. What will happen to me? Not what will happen. What will you do? Your past is not yet lost. Your future is not yet fixed. <laughs> Lay a hand on me in friendship, not quite Sharon. And I will fight the battle that has been waiting for me this last century. Then, oh then, we will have much to discuss. given me a great gift, little warrior. Don't you find it oh so curious that you would spurn your dark lady? Perhaps you feel a stirring of the truth already. But that will come later. There is a battle yet to be fought. You have done what we feared was impossible. You have released me from a century of sorrow. Your power is great. So too must be your weapon. You must choose what you will wield. And the Moon Maiden will provide. Thus I have said, thus will it be so. Are you ready?
kill Catherick Thorn. We need to leave. Lady Shah won't stand for us to be here, not after what we did. I'm not sure there's a place that's far enough away for me to go. Lady Shah must be angry. But there's only silence. Let's get out of here, please. Whatever's coming, I don't want to be in the heart of the Shadowfell when it finds me. The Night Song will be headed for Moonrise Towers. We'd better get there and see what she's unleashed against Catherick Thorne.